Hi, hi, it's me, Stitches. Willkommen, bienvenue, and welcome back to my channel. So, Freue Neue, Bon Nuit, and Happy New Year's. If you haven't figured out by now, we are going to go ahead and do some drink mixing. As most celebrations involve libations over the years, I have found that my favorite is not, unfortunately, Prosecco. So, I have figured out some ways to basically make it more palatable for myself and my friends. So, as we are going to go ahead and go with our first drink, our first drink is going to be the Bellini. It is basically two ounces of peach preserve along with Prosecco. And what I've done right here is just blended up some canned peaches because puree, my apologies on that, and you need about two ounces of that. So since my glass is quite small, I am only going to use two tablespoons. So go ahead and put that off to the side, and then add in our Prosecco. Okay, it's a Bellini. Bottoms up. That's our first drink. Now our second drink is one of my husband's favorites, actually. It's a mimosa. It's mimosa, not mimosa. Okay, so it's a mimosa. So that's basically champagne and orange juice. Now, since we are gonna stick with one drink one drink only, or one type of liquor, except for at the end. We're just going to go ahead and use the Prosecco in a traditional champagne flute. Go ahead and add the Prosecco. Leave enough room to be able to top it off with some orange juice. Now, my tip is to go ahead and just use 100% orange juice, no pulp. It makes it more palatable, and it also does not have those little pieces floating around in it. Okay. That's pretty much all you do. Now, if you want to make this into a non-alcoholic beverage, you can do the same thing with orange juice and Sprite. So, I'll go ahead and put that one off to the side. So, now for the big one. This one's gonna take a little bit of effort. So, you basically start off with a lemon sorbet. Mmm, fancy, right? So, go ahead and get a spoon. Okay. So, take a nice big spoonful of sorbet. Place that into your glass. Go ahead and set that off to the side. This drink is called, I am going to butcher it, it is called a Scapalini e Limon. So, essentially you have a standard vodka, which you're going to mix one shot of that. So one shot of vodka, along with your lemon sorbet and your Prosecco. Okay. Go ahead and start muddling that. You want the sorbet to be somewhat slushy. But don't mix it up too much because you will start fizzing this over, okay? Okay. This is Scarpini e Limon. It's an Italian drink. So, bottoms up. For any cocktail, you can basically substitute for champagne you can go ahead and use a lemon Sprite soda. 
our lemon lime soda. I'm gonna use Sprite and it's not sponsored. So basically, your lemon lime soda and add in a splash of orange juice. It gives it that razzle dazzle without being alcoholic and there are several reasons why we do and why we don't drink and all of them are valid. So remember, drink responsibly and enjoy the new year with your family and your friends and always have a wonderful season. So let's go ahead and get back to the party and we'll see you next year. Tschüssi!